Hello, this is John. Welcome to the third review on Review Day for me. Today, I'm going to be reviewing something that I eat too much of already, but I've never actually done a review. And that is Jenny's ice cream. If you have a Jenny's ice cream near you, you should go and get some. If not, they ship uh, across the nation, USA at least, I know. And whatever you choose, you won't be disappointed. They even have dairy-free items that are made with coconut cream, and they're probably the best non-dairy ice cream I've ever had in my life. It's not overly coconutty. Of course, there is going to be some... Uh, residual coconut flavors out, out of it but every flavor she makes is so good that you won't even notice really anyway the reason why I'm doing this review is because recently Jenny's has come out with a limited edition specially made for Dolly Parton the country singer she's on the package this is Jenny's strawberry pretzel pie especially made for Dolly Parton. If you don't know, Dolly Parton has a not-for-profit where they give books to children so she can promote uh, reading at an early age. Um, it's a very good thing. Every time you purchase uh, one of these, some money goes to that organization. And these sold out so quickly. Um... And I'm going to break that down a little bit. The first day they came out, they kind of broke the Jenny's website. They tested the website to make sure it could handle things. It didn't. A lot of people were waiting for hours trying to get in, and they eventually said, you know what, we're going to close it. The people that were able to get through and get theirs will send them out, but there's still uh, a lot of unsold ones left. And once we kind of figure out what we're going to do, we'll let people know 48 hours before that happens. And so they went through, they fixed their situation up. They gave 48 hours notice to everyone on social media. When it came back up, it ran really good, but it was sold out really quick. Fortunately, I was able to be the, one of the people that bought it online the first time before they shut it down. It took me like two and a half hours of refreshing the page, though. And they uh, limited you to only getting two. I got two. Uh, but this is what it is. It's a cream cheese ice cream with a pretzel streusel and a strawberry sauce. Take off the top. You'll see this. It came with a, a peel back thing that I already took off. Um, I took it off before the video so I wouldn't waste time pulling it off. Then decided to take the time in the video to describe why it wasn't there, completely defeating the purpose of me taking it off in the first place, I had to explain it. Like I said, I eat too much of this ice cream, so the challenge here is going to be to just taste it, tell you what I think, and then stopping and putting it away. Here we go. Let's get a little bit for the top. This one has a little bit of strawberry in it, but it's mostly just the cream cheese ice cream. Very good. Very uh, light. There's a piece of pretzel right here on the top that I'm going to scoop out. And then I'm going to also scoop out some strawberry sauce just so I get strawberry and pretzel in one bite. I'm fighting my desire to eat this like I typically would, which is completely. Jenny's has really perfected the idea of putting 
like crunchy things inside of ice cream. They're making it so they're not like too hard. Because they've put like cake, chunks of biscuits, and of course different kinds of cookie dough. Or like pieces of pie crust mix in their ice creams and they just do it really well I uh I think it's obviously my favorite ice cream brand um <clears throat> but it is uh one of the few that are uh, available nationwide and is better than Ben and Jerry's hmm I have a big process of crunch in it. The saltiness of the pretzel. That strawberry and cream cheese. It really comes together well. Okay. I'm gonna stop being right there. So After the first debacle, and after they sold out again, when they fixed it, they decided that since this was so popular and caused so much issue, that they're going to give people another chance. Well, they did give people another chance to pre-order a second batch. Because it was a limited edition, they only had made a certain amount. So they committed to making a second batch, which means they had to get more product and actually make it. But they sold it at a pre-order uh, later on, on the same day. And that also sold out very quickly. But I think those orders won't come out until like August. Because, again, they have to get the ingredients, make the second batch, and send it out again. Uh, but, very happy I got this. I'm going to enjoy this as well as the other pint that I got. Um... But I'm going to enjoy it at the proper time and location that I typically enjoy ice cream. And that's uh, in the middle of the night when no one else can watch and judge me. But this uh, strawberry pretzel pie ice cream, very good. I don't think it's my favorite one that I've had from Jenny's because they're all very good. Um, there's one that's a peach jam and biscuit that's very good. Uh, there's a pineapple upside down cake that's very good. I could just go through the list, and they're basically all very good. Uh, my wife really enjoys one that's called Brambleberry Crisp. Um, but you cannot go wrong with any of the Jenny's flavors. And this one, especially because you're actually going to be donating money to a good cause, makes it doubly good. Um. I don't know if I'm going to do more Jenny's reviews in the future, uh, just because it, it's it's hard for me to like save this until like a daytime that I can actually do a review, and uh, I prefer eating it, my ice cream in the middle of the night. So, with that, I'll bid you adieu. Hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Tell me what your favorite time of the day to eat a pint of ice cream is in the comment section below. See you later.